Hi everyone, today we are going to be talking about a very important topic, food wastage. Now, we all have foods that we love, like hot, cheesy pizza, freshly baked cookies, crispy french fries, and so much more. But, we also have foods that we may not like as much, like rice and dal or vegetables like spinach. And sometimes, if we really don't like a food, we tend to waste it, right? Think about it, when was the last time you threw away food? I'm sure we've all wasted food at least once before. But, we have to remember that all food is nutritious, whether we like it or not. And all the foods we eat take a lot of time to prepare. So, where do you think your food comes from? Hint, the answer is not the kitchen. Let me take you on a journey to describe just how all our food is prepared, from the farm to the fork. First, a farmer has to plow the soil to get it ready for farming. Then, the farmer must plant the seeds of lots of different fruits and vegetables. These take time to grow. Sometimes a seed will take a few weeks to grow, other times it will take months. Once the crops have grown completely, the farmer has to harvest them using lots of heavy machinery. The harvested fruits and veggies are then transported to factories and sold for very high prices. At the factories, the foods are processed and packaged for commercial use. The packaged foods are carried to local grocery stores where they are neatly organized for you and your family to buy them. Once the fruits and vegetables reach your home, they have to be washed, peeled, cut and finally cooked to make the healthy meals we're all used to. So now do you see why eating all your food is important? A lot of time and effort goes into preparing your meals every day and we should always be grateful to have food on our tables because not everyone around the world has that same privilege. I hope you've all learned how important not wasting food is today and please remember to thank whoever is cooking your meal for doing such a good job.